Hey everybody! Welcome back to more The Cave! Where we are trying to give our dog some food. Oh crap. Whoopsie! <laughs> but it's not without challenge. Last time we came here we did some stuffs. And today we continue with the stuffs until we feed the dog. That's that's the goal. And I must say, this game it is beautiful. It has exactly the right amount of puzzling. It has. She's gonna say, "Quiet, children." It has funny writing. It's everything you look for in the game, and more. Kids building a fort. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, is it not? No, no. What was that crash I heard upstairs? Here we go. Uh, I don't know what you are referring to, Mother. There was no crash. No nothing. Oh, that's... Mm -mm. The umbrella is back. Wait, do I need it? Did it reset when I... Saved the game and exited? Maybe. But just in... Just in case it did... Is this the room? No, this is not the room. I need to go up one more. Here we are. Aha, look at this. But I am gonna need the full chamber pot. Full with water from the faucet. Beautiful. This thing is very handmade. Ah, yes. Mm, the smell of rotting sewage floating in the Thames. Thick industrial smoke choking the air. And horse manure piled high on every street corner. Ah, it must be springtime in London. <laughs> so, there's a fire down there that I think I just put out. This is gonna be harder than it should be. Oh, you can climb this I'd thing. I'd make a Mary Poppins joke right now, except that it's not in the public domain. Sued <laughs> <laughs> again. <laughs> you see what I'm saying about great writing? All right, open up the study door. Well, the twins have the run of the house now. <laughs> what kind of mischief will they get into next? Well, I don't know. I'm gonna get dog food, that's for sure. Down in the cellar. Here we go. Is there anything else? We have now reached the grimmest part of our grim story. Oh god. For that small box shoved into the corner is the ticket out of this house for the twins. Let's watch, shall we? <laughs> uh -oh. If you dare. So... Hum... Rat poison. That don't look too friendly. Anyway, let's feed the dog now. Now these guys should be able to to come back. Shouldn't should shouldn't they? Uh huh. Come on. The dog is gone. 
and while he's sleeping, I don't know if it's timed or anything. Somebody said I love soup. Who loves soup? I, well, I like soup, but... I wouldn't see how it's important to... Okay, so this is where we eventually will end up. I see it clearly now. Steam wealth. Anything else? Anything? This goes far. Wow, hey. Um, okay. Is this hackable? No. Okie dokie. Now that the steam is off, I can it's get to that rat poison. I have a bad feeling about this, guys. Rat poison. <laughs> you know, if one were to examine this box of rat poison carefully, the instructions would read... One small thimbleful added to food will cause intense, horrifying, and excruciating death. Side effects include tingling, blurred vision, occasional dryness of the mouth, and getting to go outside and play. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, oh, this soup is for us, not the rats. Oh, go play with that rat poison somewhere else. <laughs> what a good mother. So, how am I going to get the rat poison in that soup? Please don't touch the soup, my dears. I have all the ingredients just like you like them. Um. Okay. How am I gonna do this? There's nothing else down here, as far as I know. So get the key back. I need to lure the mother away somehow. The only way I could think of is with the dog. Can I get him a bone? That the, 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 the dog is doing something that arouses the suspicion of the mother. Because the hillbilly is trying to get their, peop their children to escape. But I am not confident this is gonna do anything. I did it now. Soup is ready and it smells delightfully delicious. Okay, you try. You two darlings go wash up for dinner. Don't take too long or we might start without you. <laughs> oh, I'm hoping for it. Damn. Killing their parents. What a normal thing to do. Get it. Over there. Doing as they're told? <laughs> the twins might be turning over a new leaf. Do you hear that? Uh oh. Let's examine the dining room. <sighs> you see, this is why I never had kids. <laughs> well, that and being a cave with no real form of reproduction. But that's beside the point. The point is. The twins, well, I don't know if there is a point to their madness, but they may find their newfound freedom comes at a cost greater than they're capable of imagining. And as with the rest of our travelers, and perhaps even you, I guess only time will tell. Shall we continue our journey? Yes. It's been so enlightening thus far. Ooh, I can't wait to see what happens next. Uh, where, where's the skeleton key? Did I bring it up or did I leave it down here? I thought I, bro I, think I brought it up. Is 
that so? Is that the case? Yes, it is. Knocking it out. Hey, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> that actually is horrifying. Okay, cave tour. Oh! Wow, I. Wow. There was a lever inside of the. wall. I may need some sort of. guy to do that. That I don't have in my party. Alright. There's the other two. There's the music again. Okay. So we've seen the story of the hillbilly. We've seen the story of the twins. I'm guessing the scientist is gonna be Ah, the Next. zoo. Observe nature's wondrous and terrible beauty, safely imprisoned behind unbreakable steel bars. Very good. Whoa! Well, damn! Jesus! This place is a nightmare. I hate zoos. No, I never like zoos. Never. Oh my gosh. Things are getting real up in here. What the heck? Beast Hunter Podcast Day 541. Huh? The Crystal Cave Monster escaped again. She's still hungry, so I'm camped out near her favorite food. Hot dogs. When I hear her shriek and roar. The hunt is on. Oh. Oh, blast. This worthless gizmo is out of batteries. So I now got a worthless gizmo. Don't touch those hot dogs. Hey, who are you? Don't touch those hot dogs. Seriously? She just shot twins. Battery less tape recorder. I'll gladly take that. Maybe there's some intel on there. Yeah, there's a teddy bear. No pianos. No, what is that? What in the hell is that? I don't know. Oh! Oh look, he's safe after all. <laughs> Surely there are no limits to the charity and altruism this pair can bring to the world now that they've been reunited. Um. Okay, there's a dude in there. I have no clue what I'm supposed to do. <sighs> that killed me. Okay, I cannot get back. Let's see if she can explore some other part. I mean, this is gonna be... Oh, I thought this was gonna be deadly. But there's nothing there of interest to me. Ah, uh, no. That was just a hot dog lady. That shoot, shoots people because they get near a vending machine. Because that's how people are. I feel like I need to be three guys standing on there. Oh, nope. Let's get down first. 
Just in case. Okay. Oh no, that's just if you fall into the hole, you can get back out. Or so it seems. Oh, that's how you... That's how you get back out. So... I see what... Oh, that's how you get back. Door control console, you can hack that. This makes it easier. Okay, now, yeah, yeah, this is how, how we get back. But we can only get two people back. Is it enough to crush the bridge? I would guess no. But you never know. No, no. It ain't enough. Okay. My god, this is oh, finicky. Okay. Nothing up there. Ah, these three. I had high hopes when they first arrived, but you'd be surprised how useless a clown can be in a high pressure life and death situation. <laughs> Seriously? There's a battery. A dead battery. Pro tip, that battery probably needs a charge. Its owner hasn't had much chance to maintain it recently. Yeah. It looks like it. So, we need electricity. Some sort of outlet or... Wait, no. Ah, too quick on the, on the draw. Is there electricity down here? No. They don't do nothing. Is there a fuse somewhere? Fuses seem to be very. Uh, the, the developers and game designers, or game designer, I don't know, seem to be very fond of fuse puzzles. Maybe they had a traumatic. Experience with the fuse. Move away from the vending machine. Oh no, no, not back here. Crazy lady shooting two kids, innocent kids. Well, they killed their parents. Like that battery is all charged up now. <laughs> that was actually quite cool. I like that. I didn't know, I didn't think of the eels when I went back up. It just came to me when I was up there that hey, we got eels. Alrighty. Get up and go get the, the tape recorder. Put the battery in and listen. Uh -oh. oh, seriously? Oh, yeah, can't get through there. Gotta get, gotta go the long way. 
But here we are. Can we play it somehow? Recording. What are we recording? No. That can't be it. Huh. Well, whatever else happens down here, our heroes could always consider careers as nature documentarians. Yeah. So maybe that was what I needed to record? Let's show it to the lady. Crazy lady. Killed me a bunch of times. Oh. It's the base. Get her away from the machine. From the oh, no matter. Valor waits for no woman. All of that for a Frankfurter. Well, at least it's kosher. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get a few of these out again, like last time. Let's not be greedy. Moderation in all things. Okay, three sausages. <laughs> that sounded dirty in my mind. Hey, beast! Got you something? So I just died. What? Seriously? Seriously? So we can lure it with the bait. But where to? Ah, oh, probably to the bridge. That would be my guess. It's time for science! The science of solving puzzles. Hot dog. Okay. Let's try and lure that base to the bridge. Mm, here, smelly, smelly. Here, smelly, smelly. Ah. <laughs> Whoa, oh no. There we go. This has gone on long enough. Oh, hey, wow. Jeez. I suppose it's true what they say. If you want to make an omelet, you have to consign the last member of an ancient species to oblivion while destroying someone else's lifelong dreams and desires. <sighs> <laughs> I guess. So, this has been it for episode 5 of The Cave. I... Thank you very, very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.